Water, water everywhere, but not a drop to drink. The poem of the ancient mariner could never be more relevant than today. Two thirds of our planet is covered in water, and nearly 98% of that water exists as salt water in our seas and oceans. And if, at the same time, if we look, the UN estimates that by 2030, nearly half the world won't have access to clean water. And I'd like you to think about that for the moment. What does a world look like in a little over a decade from now? What does our world look like in a little, in a little over a decade? So the question is, is it possible that we can take this salt water and that we can desalinate it and turn it into drinking water? Well, desalination has been around for a number of years. Today, around 0.5% of the world's drinking water supply comes from desalination. But it comes at a cost. It comes at a cost of around 1% of the world's total energy uh, 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 sources. And not only is, is it a cost uh, of energy, it is uh, uh, something that is completely unsustainable. Around four barrels of water created through desalination require around one barrel of oil to make. So it's completely unsustainable. So it begs the question, is it possible that we can desalinate water in a sustainable, clean, and safe way? Well, enter desalinator. Desolinator is 100% solar-powered desalination technology. It can take water from almost any source, including seawater, uh, contaminated water, arsenic-contaminated water, brackish water, and using a process of distillation can turn seawater into drinking water. This is a household uh, product that we're developing, and it'll give around 20 liters of water per day. That's enough for a family's drinking needs, but we're also developing a community-sized version, which will bring around five to 6,000 liters of water to communities per day. And what's the implication of this? Well, whether you're in Chile, or whether you're in the Middle East, or whether you're on an island in Indonesia, if you have this desolinator technology, you can, as long as you have sun, and you have some kind of water source, you can achieve what we like to call water independence. Okay? Now, uh, Desolinator, we're having an incredible journey as an organization. We've got this amazing adventure underway, and we're on track to bringing both the household and community systems to market in 2018. We're currently doing field trials in Dubai. We raised seed funding earlier this year, and we've got a passionate team based here in London, in the UK, who are working very hard to bring this to market. And, you know, as well as uh, 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 thinking about this, it's very abstract uh, numbers of one billion people and so forth. But pictures like this, the kind of images you'll be seeing all over the world. This is the face of the water crisis. And a desolinator, we're passionate about making a dent in this crisis. We believe that with our products, with our technologies, that we can literally help millions of people to, be, to achieve what we call water independence. And I ask you to join us and help us, family by family, household by household, and community by community, to bring water independence to the world. Thank you very much. <laughs>